Yes, welcome to a whole new video. We're in Answert Woods. We're going to walk through Answert Woods and check it out and see what's going on, people. Yeah, a long time I make no video. I'm just trying. College. Yeah, but yeah, I'm here. Answert Hood for you, people. We're going to see the logs in Answert Wood. The difference between Hansworthwood and Hansworth. Some part might not look too good. Some part looks all right. But yeah, some nice houses around here. We're on Amstead Hill going down to Great Bar, not far from Great Bar. Great Bar, matter of fact, Great Bar just down the road. But yeah, some lovely house around here still. A nice big great house. And loads of clothes. Clothes. We call them. Nice house over there. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. I hope it ain't rain. It looks like it's going to rain, man. <coughs> yeah, some nice houses down here. Not much of a gated community, but does. Some nice big house. A lot of Indians live down here as well. Majest Asia, Isha, Isha. <coughs> That's an old speed camera been here. I want it look, look like it's been fixed. But them speed cameras are supposed to be out of commission. No, it does look clean. <coughs> pardon me, pardon me. <coughs> Let's see what's down there. Oh, I remember this church. My brother come and preach at this church before from Antigua. You know some pastor. Down here. I remember dropping them off right here at this church. Bring my memories. That was years ago. And my whole family coming from America, come and visit me, most of them. And my brother came from Antigua with his wife and come up here. But well, this look like a private um, road as well. Not really private, but yeah. Elmwood, Elmwood Church Park. Okay. Yeah, it look private. It's not really private, but you know what I mean. I was looking to rent a house back in the days for me and my ex in Answer Hood. Nice big house. What's this building? That's a different church. 
Close battle. Look like it used to be a church. Let's see where my camera ain't going on something. My stick was a plug in good for my game bar to work. I was wondering, oh, I ain't seeing nothing coming up, but yeah, I'm in 4K now anyway. I was trying to go up and down on my zoom, but yeah, when something ain't plugging right, it ain't, it ain't the end there. But yeah, like I said, a lot of Indians live around here. I can tell this ain't an old church, this is a new church. Yeah. But yes, people. We're back on it. Trying to be back on it. Trying to fit in one and two video within my schedule. That's what I'm going to see you doing. But the way that has been... What they would normally call it shit, but... I wouldn't much 100%. It's just frigging in and out. No, it's going back cold. It was hot yesterday. It's cold and then it started raining. So you got loads of different temperature in the weather. There's a church. I'll show you a little quick part of Anzert. Andrew Wood. I hear them making that nice car in a while. Making up real nice. Yeah, more like the Indian community live down this past side. He'll drive. Not much. But yeah, these are houses I'm saying. They got great big houses. See that big one? These are the old time rich people owning. Always says, you know, they got the poor people house and they got the rich people house back in the days. Them great big house, like big family. Yeah, these are the ones, some of these. That's massive, you know. That's like fucking family, 20 probably living there. But yeah, people. <clears throat> Red bricks. Yeah, you see what I'm talking about? Big house. 16 running Homestead Road. You got the rich one. You got the middle class over there. You have money. Have a little bit of money. Then you got have no money in the little houses. Tame Grove Private Road. No parking. 
them look like new houses they put up around there. Like they buy them houses, a big piece of land, and they just fucking build up cul de sac. private. What's that car over there? I don't even remember. Must be some on high on that or something. But yeah, that's land. See, look like they got loads of land behind these old houses as well. Like they used to have loads of land, probably half an acre, I would say, half a quarter acre. That's still big land. Um, this would be the upcoming middle class. Apartments would be the upcoming middle class and these big houses would be the rich family. The wall and the bush, nice. Enough of these people need home maintenance, cutting the bushes and so forth. I around here, I don't even know. I swear there's always a college or a um, uni, uni um, accommodation around here or something. Walk down there and see what's going on. Brown's Green Lodge. See, well maintained. What's that? That's, uh, that's stop and start. I don't know why. Women in 4K. Oh, it's a bin truck, man. The bin truck smelling stunk. But yeah, hands are a hood for you. The bin, the bin truck stank. Stonk, stonk, stonk. Yeah, like I said, a lot of, um, yeah. Lots of big houses around here. And a renovation going on. I was look, yeah, not around this side. But the house was big where I was looking to rent. Well, I don't remember if it was this side or not. But yeah, that's on the renovation. That's been done, that's been done nice as well. Yeah, big gate. Rubbish out the front. Yeah, also is a nice round here. Yeah. Vehicle on there. A renovation. It's that um, armor. Massive armor. It must be all over the petrol. Uh, 
this end down there. It looked like the road it was going to rent on when I think about it. You know. It was like a friggin' five or six bedroom house or something. Four bedroom, we had four kids or something like that. I swear it looked like this <laughs> down there. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh. But yeah, nice house. Uh, not my college idea on this though. I realize. Me no realize. Nice big cult, um, bungalow. They're doing work over there. Yes, people, Answerwood, the nice part of Answerwood. You got have money to live around here. You're talking like mills, yeah. Not thousands, mills. No 100,000 or 200,000 house around here. 200,000 pounds. Talking like. Yeah, not even half a meal. Unless you buy something that's break going down, breaking down. <coughs> we'll continue walking Amstead Road. We got some old style house around there. You notice everything, no most of them got red bricks. Yeah. But yes. It was a bin truck or smelling smell like shit. Like proper shit. This person. They put up them stone. They look like they took them stone from somewhere. <laughs> I'd have been there a long time. Yeah, they've been there a long time, growing mirage, you know. People doing lawn. Yeah. I should go across there to see There's some apartments. <coughs> I swear there used to be loads of students over there. Answerth Wood Road. Glad there was Amstead Road. So that would be piece somebody land to build a house right here. The big fucking line at the front. House built way back. Still in one bedroom and three bedroom flat to let. So if you want something in Android Wood, over there is decent, that is nice. Over there.
Oh, go on. Who is that? It's not LT. It look like LT. Yes, back. I am. I just seen my friend. I ain't seen in a while. This mom passed away. Feel, I feel it, man, friend. And not no shame. I suffer from no sickness. Damn. I want to tell everybody that's watching my video, man. Try to live your life, man. You don't know when your time's gonna come, man. Just try to live your life. I just randomly see one of my friends. I ain't seen for a couple of months or a year. A couple of years, one or two years. But I speak to him, though. His mom was good and healthy. His dad, retired police, Jamaican. He was big in the force, medic, and his mom just told me his mom passed away, man. She'd been to the hospital for some random thing, and she does then seven days, and then she passed away about a fortnight, man. Really sad, man. Sad, sad. They're investigating it. It's good to go to hospital sometime, but it's bad, man, because it's like, it's like the experiment on you, man. That's why I didn't even go with you, Corona, man. Even my mom in America, she had corona, she ain't take no job, nothing. She's still alive, not suffering for anything. More than a couple of years back, she had a heart attack and she had a pacemaker put in her heart. In her heart. <laughs> my sister went to go change the battery the other day after a couple of years. And they said she didn't even need it, that means she probably just get... She didn't need a battery change. And my mom, I think in her 80s, Yeah, people, let's live your life, man. Enjoy your life. I'm just trying to get back into work right now. That's why I'm doing the college thing, because I've been out of work since January. And I don't want going to none of them deadbeat jobs no more, man. Them deadbeat jobs, they want you to do a lot and pay shit. And then try to bully you. I don't know them politics, Rob. I just want a, a job that can pay and get some money. Next five, ten years, let's put in some work. And so I can go on my holiday, man. I meant I um, really want to do holidays with you. Going to different countries or something like that. Not necessarily bringing... Um, not necessarily walking around in Birmingham, really. Just, just want to do some holiday video. Go different countries. And I've done a lot in Birmingham. That's why I ain't been doing nothing, really. And my motivation is kind of friggin'. Yeah. Motivation just gone kind of weak. Going you going college and doing that study and then friggin I just need to do that medical and then yeah do that medical do two more weeks but it's just different time schedule man that's long you need to get off the system back man I hate being on the system really I don't know people think they wanna be on it forever I've been on it like January, I was like February, March, April, May, four months. And I hate it, man. I hate the feeling. I think as a man, you should at least try. So I'm smoking roll up, stop smoking weed. Clean my system. But yeah, man. Life, man.
and never tell what's going to happen when things happen. What's this place there? See, that look like some Indian place going to come up. But yeah, these are some of the house. But yeah, my friend, that's, ah, oh, damn. His mum passed away, man. I can't believe it. His dad going to be lonely now. You know, when somebody passed away and they ain't been suffering from no sickness, no known sickness, and all of a sudden they got a little something and they go to the hospital, and then boom, they just die. True replacement information. Yeah, that's mad. Well, let me walk back down this one. I feel. Yeah, man. I just want to go in some go some places before the good Lord, uh, my soul leave my body. Yeah. But yeah, this Android Wood people. <clears throat> this Android Hood. Are old for you. I was going to walk more up Amstead, but I need to take a leap now. I need to go down. I want to go somewhere else. I'm going to see if I can go there. But you said I ain't got no money and I ain't working. I try to limit my where I go and what I do so I can survive. Because if you don't do that, mate, you're not going to survive. It's going to be hard. Answered Wood Road. Like I said, loads of big houses around there. Nice houses. All eight um, right near the um, historical building. I'm not gonna say historical, but old architects. Great big house. Yeah. <coughs> And I guess maybe the white population probably moved out because the crime in Anza it was creeping up on them. So people probably said that also oh, Indians were by But I don't think there's not much crime around. There's no, I don't hear no about no crime around here, really. Anza would. I never hear anything happening in Anza would. Even though I don't watch the fake news no more like that. But. Maybe other part of Answer would, because like I say, it ain't all great big houses, but it's known for them great big houses and oh, some old architect. I don't know how old the architects them are, but some of them pretty old, I know. These were the, um, what days was these? So, I think the most, some of the white population, not mall, a lot still live around there. Probably a little bit, probably sell out, sell a little house and move out. And Asian Indians bite. As most of the Indians I see around there. A new brighter diamond. But yeah. Yeah, what's the sad news? I don't know if his mom Jamaican as well. I know his dad is. Damn. Ah. He's uh, LT probably in his 
churches, late churches, or early churches. So I don't think his mom probably in her 60s. Yeah, that's what I would reckon she'd probably be in her 60s. Uh, yeah. I just, just don't go to the mob. Sad, sad, sad. Sad. But yeah, life. You know that people die every day. When somebody, you know, kind of close to home, kind of make you like think about life and start wondering. Oh, true. I'm walking through the advertising that place, but it's nice apartments over here. Like I said, they're decent. They're decent. Or decent. So if you want to inquiry, that's it. Pause the video and look. Android would. But yes, yes, yes. Android would apartments. There's not much to see up here. Not much to see, not much to see. I think this leads back up to Soul Road. The British flag, you know, the British person in a flat. <laughs> You're not wrong with that, mate. But you know, a lot of you British. We're in the British run, so you should be proudly showing your flags and proud of your country. Right, one thing I know, y'all, and proud of your religion. If more people stick up with their religion and be skated as well, so it's well secure driving in. Yeah. Everybody should be proud of where they're from, man. Whether you want to raise a flag or not, up to you. I ain't see nothing wrong with it. But yeah. Oh! That just hit me. See a friend and told his mom passed away. You're like, what? Did your mom pass away? Was she suffering from no sickness? No. She went to hospital, in there for seven days, and then she passed away. You're like, huh? How is that? You see, it's well secure people. So if you think about well, coming here to live, you know that you're secure in answer it. <laughs> the answer it does up the road. Not far. As much as this hands are hood. <coughs> I ain't gonna go no further. There ain't no big house up this side. Some normal house, like I said, middle class. And then you got the um the rest of the class. You got upper class, middle class, and lower class. <laughs> Oh, these are not middle class, not upper class. That's like a lower class. I'm not one to be judged on judgment. There could be upper class. That's like bungalow. That's like something where you put your mom when she get older, gets from the government. That's how I look on these bungalows. You know, you're not too want to go on the step. That's why I gotta keep my legs and exercise. 
Gonna be 50 this year. Got eight grandkids. Figure now. Think by the time I'm 60, I suppose if I have a dozen. I don't know. I don't know. These are people like in between middle and yeah, surviving. I just own a house though. But yeah, you probably fine. Probably three, four, five hundred thousand bees houses around there. But then what you was I saw me showing you. Them house, nice tree. Oh we're going to curve. Yeah, this rubber mill. Armstead Hall. I thought that that's some great big house in Armstead Hall. I know where it leads to. If it leads to up there and go around, I'm not quite sure. But see how I walk around there. Uh, <sighs> sorry, Mom passed away. Sad, sad news. We we'll get some sad news. We feel it for someone. Yeah. I should have brought my coat, man. Yes, the rain wet me, boat. Eight o'clock, I was outside, it was light up. I was out there from probably five, four, changing my oil on my car. It was nice and warm. I wouldn't say that nice, but not that warm, but you know. And then it started pouring down at about eight, and I was getting in as I finished. And I come in, cool down, have a shower. And I wake up feeling like I'm getting sick. <laughs> oh, that's the only bad thing about the weather. I don't like friggin' rain. The rain is good. Don't get me wrong. Rain is good, but me getting wet, not good. But yeah. <clears throat> you see when the summer coming back everything that's greenery and nice they should name Andre Greenwood when the winter come it's all beard and dry and look scavenger Funny how these trees survive through the winter, through the harshest winter by shedding all the leaves. Just overtaking the cars coming. Fucking idiot. Can't wait. Property for us there, they can check that property out.
was doing yesterday, putting in a car and service in it, hard service. I need to change the brakes, and the air filter, and the spark plug brakes, and then I need to change one part. And nice house around here as well. You can see people only got money. Cars on the drive, Porsche and so. So them house, Park Hill Drive. Going back down, man. Get in the car. Feel chilly. Feel like I'm going to sick. But, yeah. These people need to trim up a tree going off in the sidewalk. You're responsible for your property. Anything is on it. So should be cutting the edges to make sure the road clean. Clean up these. cool and nice and quiet that's all I know like I said yeah I was looking to live around here one time back way back in the days rent was it that out to reach when, especially if you got two of you working family but now Probably about over a grand two, grand three, grand to rent a property around here. Yeah. You see my friend renting a flat off Dudley Road, new flats. And he's paying over a grand. That's just a flat. I rather rent a house, man. Nice house there. Going back down the hill, Anzor Wood, Hampstead Hill. Turn on this star uh, truck in my face. Look, down over there is great bar down down. The prison, I can't see nowhere where I can push no car and I can go. But yeah, people, we're gonna end this video because right now I want to piss, man. If I can hold this to get to my yard. But yeah, I'll catch you later. Peace out.